you know, one of the things that uh, one of my hobbies is actually coding and billing. So, you know, I developed. A, <laughs> That's a fun life you live, John. Uh, yeah, like oh, man, seriously. I'm not staying in his house. I'm not staying in his house. <laughs> so we're we're very aggressive. The, the reality is with these insurance companies, uh, you, you need to be pretty aggressive. One of the ways around, um, you know, being a small business, IPAs, independent physician associations, where you can essentially the beer, obviously. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Not the beer, um, but essentially, what you could do is you, you can essentially go, you know. With with a group that's represented of a bunch of other physicians in the in the area, <clears throat> and then th- you'll have a little more negotiation power with those insurances. Is this like a GPO? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And so was you GPO always for have everyone? a group purchasing organization. Perfect. Yeah. Just for the people at home. <clears throat> Not all insurance carriers are taking that long. I mean, there are, for instance, Medicare typically will pay you in approximately thirty days. Um, you just want to be careful with Medicare billing. You want to make sure you're doing everything correctly because they pay up front and they're not going to look at it until one day you get audited and you want to make sure that everything's actually done accurately because if they start seeing things in your billing that are inaccurate, they will typically you know, start looking back and, and that's when you can run into some trouble. 